this is a story from Finland. It is called A Hunter's Joke. A married man went hunting in the forest several times. One fall, he had very, very bad luck. He was told that if he offered himself to the devil, the devil would help him and give him good luck in return. So one night he called upon the devil. Once the devil shows up, he asks, What's on your mind, my child? And the hunter replies, Nothing. The devil says, Yes, there's something. Just tell me. And the hunter comes forward and says, My hunting luck has been really bad lately. I come to you in hope of change. The devil then offers him an agreement, saying, I'll give you three years in this island swamp, and I'll send you every prey, but you have to hunt down a bird that I've never seen before. Upon failure, I'll collect your soul. The hunter, trying to outsmart the devil, agrees to this, and he says, let's make the agreement. And the devil says, for us to seal the agreement, you'll have to cut the tip of your finger and let your blood touch the tip of this paper. The man then went to the island, and he was able to spend just a few hours there each day. He would get loads of birds and as much forest game as he could ever possibly wish for. For three years, he goes on hunting on the island, and eventually he becomes rich from all of the game that he is able to shoot. He lives a very good life with his wife, but he never reveals to her the secret agreement. Just days before the three years are over, the man believes that his soul will be collected by the devil since he was never able to kill the bird that the devil didn't recognize. So he tells his wife about the agreement. The wife says, you are really stupid. Here is a bird for him that he doesn't know. On the last morning, you can tar me well and I'll get into this feather basket and roll around and then he will not recognize me. That morning, she was covered in the feathers and they went into the forest. The devil appears and asks if he is ready to have his soul collected. He reminds the devil that he is free if he is able to shoot a bird that he doesn't recognize. And the devil says, well, did you do this? He tells him that he shot the bird this morning and then takes him to it. The devil does not recognize the bird and asks how he managed to kill such a big one. And then he says, aha, you shot it with two bullets. And the man says, yes, that's exactly how it happened. The devil then says that for three more years, he will drive game to the island for the hunter. And then the devil went away. The man and his wife went home and had quite a job cleaning her off. She had to be scrubbed several times and they even used a sauna to help loosen the tar from her body. The game provided enough money for the couple to last their entire lifetime. And the wife said, didn't I say he wouldn't recognize me? How can he recognize something that he's seeing for the first time? And that was the tale. Now for this performance, I tried to use my hands a little bit more, use a little bit of inflection in my voice, and emphasize different parts of the story especially when some of the characters were speaking. So I tried to incorporate those parts into my performance of A Hunter's Joke.